This is Anthony, and we're going to talk about how photographers use geometry in photography. Now, for me, one way I use geometry when I'm photographing is when I'm looking through that viewfinder, I want to use what's called the rule of thirds, meaning that I want my subject, my background, whatever I'm photographing, broken down into a rule of thirds in that viewfinder, meaning that nothing, none of these rules are set in stone, but it's almost like a basic primer for photographers. But I don't want my image or whatever right in the middle. I want to switch it around a little bit. And that's one way that I use geometry in my photography. So when I'm looking through that viewfinder, and there are some camera viewfinders that you can actually buy what's called a grid. And it goes right on the camera so I can almost see the geometrics in that image with my grid. The other rule in photography that I use is the rule of parallax or converging lines. When I'm photographing architecture or a building, my lines are going to go in. It's just the way that photography, the way optics are. There are certain cameras that have, it's called a lens shift or a PC lens that will actually bring those lines when they're going in to straight. Now if I'm photographing architecture, the architect is certainly going to want to make his building, his house, look straight and not like it goes in. So that's one way, a couple of ways actually, that photographers use geometry in photography.